What is up, guys? Video game Jay and Poop again, back with more Banjo Tooie. And in the last episode, we have tackled on the Sparrow Mountain parts, and we've also finished the um, a part of the Jinjo Village, and we've unlocked a new world from Jiggy Wiggy or Master Jiggy Wiggy. And in this episode, we're going to um, go to this new world and hopefully find a lot more Jiggies here. And bear in mind, these worlds take so long, so some of these episodes might be an hour long, I don't know. I'll have to see on that, though. So hopefully, I'll try and make them, uh, like, a few minutes, but still. Um, let's go in this area. We're in Mayhem Temple. This is the one I'd find in the one as well, and you'll be able to walk between them. Ah, uh, yeah, so we can walk between worlds now as well. So yeah, Mayhem Temple, and we have these notes right here, which we get five each. You found some notes, boy! No, come and find me! Alright, so yeah, so you don't have to... And and unlike Kazooie, you don't have to worry about dying and then you don't have to collect the notes again. They are permanently collected, even on N64. Hey, get the sorry hide over here and press B! Alright then. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm right here. Oh yeah, so we have Jam Jaws right here, so it's apparently Bottles' brother? Bottles' brother, I think? Oh god, his eyes! He's so angry. So what he does, just like Bottles in the previous game, he'll teach you some moves. Got enough. So Egg Aim is our first one. He'll just tell you how to use them. this! Right, and then, and you have a cool music, the I don't know where we're about to music, and then, um, and, and he gives you this move, which allows you to, uh, aim your eggs, which you gotta, I'm getting confused a bit here, just hold on. Shoot them. And then shoot. Uh, there we go, and then we open this. Right here. Then we gotta go in here. Right. Treasure chamber. Meet this guy. What's up with you? It's terrible! The can't find Darkest's favorite priceless relic thingy! Tough luck, we don't care. <laughs> A cheeky? Well, in that case. Great. I'll open the other door for you. Alright. So we can go up there. Oh, we can get a cheaper page up here as well. So that's another reason why we want to be here. And these honeycomb honeycomb pieces as well. Yeah, I know what it is, jam jars. I know. Right, back in Mayhem Temple. Fine. Another warp pad, so we can now warp. Right. Okay, so... Oh, we have this thing, a globo. We have Mumbo Skull. We got the globo! They're supposed to be magical powers! Well, no, we give one to Mumbo, and then another character, which we'll meet later on. For now, it's Mumbo, though. Ah, bear and bird here at last. Bum 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 Yeah, you sure are. We got a go. Get magic creature to bumbo. What else? Yes, we have to agree to things now. Sure. Throw it in bumbo's sack. Alright. And then this time, you get a cool element of the game. You get to play as Mumbo Jumbo! Yay! And you can even use this as an attack, which you can stun enemies before killing them with it. So it stuns them for a bit and then it kills them. Alright. So I'm gonna collect these notes and then there's a there's a secret note you can get here first. Right. Oh, this! If you collect that. You've collected the skill stop honeycomb! Press X to stop your energy bar as close to the top as possible. Oh no! <coughs> oh god. So yeah, those things are annoying. I don't recommend you get them. 
Right, in the water. So we get a treble clef. That means you get, like, 20 notes from each. So we got all notes in uh, this one. This one. Summon Golden Goliath. Okay. So yeah, if you get a, tre a treble clef, then that means you get 20 notes from them. So, so we got all the notes here, so we don't need to collect more. So where this gold now? Bumbo magic gold. Right, so I think. So what we can do here is we use the golem to kick things. So there's a secret passage there. And then we gotta make the golem walk in another place. So we need to go to this door right here, which is similar. Oh no, I'm in the water! Oh. oh god. I think I'm gonna fail this. Maybe, I don't know. So I wanted to try and get a, uh, a walk pad in there as well. Something else. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna fail this. But hey, we can always do it again. But I always prefer to do this on first try, so then it makes it quicker then. I can at least try and get this um, jiggy, though. That is this side. But I guess we can try and kick something else. Let's go here. So that's a second jiggy here. Or oh, first jiggy in the Mayhem Temple. So it's this thing right there. That passageway. We've got to kick that. And then that's how you destroy it. Bumbo magic run out. Oh god, that's bad luck. But you can do this again. You have to watch the animation again, unfortunately. At least you can um, <clears throat> summon it again. We've already kicked that door, so we don't have to kick the remaining things again. So, so yeah, that's kind of cool. In fact, let's kick him as well. I don't know if he responds or. Yeah, let's kick him. There we go. We don't know if he comes back. Maybe he will. I don't know. Oh, yeah, the fellows. Right, now let's try and kick that door. I can also get a... Uh, I can also get this here as well. A warp pad. And I can get another globo here as well. And the globo is behind this thing. It's like a tent. And we'll visit that later on. Something else. We gotta go up here, and then that's where we need to go. We need to kick that. Let's kick him. Okay. Oh, we got the eggs as well. <laughs> well, that's actually good because I needed the eggs so bad. In fact, is it possible, even though we got the jiggy already, is it possible to actually get it from this way with that time still on? Yes, it is! There we go. There we go, and he ran out. Okay. So there, there we go. There's nothing else we can do here, so... Oh, yeah, the enemy... Of course the enemy does come back, so... That's unfortunate. There's an empty honeycomb here. We have to have a transformation, though. Which we get from somewhere else. Yeah, outside Mumbo's skull, we'll walk out, and then that's how it works. Then, and then we go back on Mumbo's seat, and then you can control Banjo and Kazooie again. Very cool how you can play as Mumbo in this game. There we go. Okay. Alright, so... Now let's get this move right here. Now this move is very important for that big temple that we just got past. Jam Jar's here again. The Briegel Blaster. So this allows for first person action. Uh, yes, there is first person mode in this game. Yeah, we can swim here. And then there's supposed to be a Jinjo. Oh, there's a black Jinjo there. And there's nine black Jinjos. Yeah, there's more black Jinjos than others. There is one white Jinjo, and I believe there's like. I think two red ones, I'm not sure. There's three yellow ones, yeah. We know that already. 
Yeah, let's go here. Okay, uh, let's go here. Let's go and transform. We're in Wombas Wigwam. Oh, 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 And this is how you transform in this game. He goes a humble woman this time. Wonder how this story. Right. And then you just jump back in if you want to transform back. So yeah, we're a, a small stony banjo. Yay! Yes, you can punch enemies as well. This is very cool. Uh, let's go to the entrance. Uh, there's only one place you will need this stony though. Oh, and uh, oh, and that uh, honeycomb thing as well. Uh, besides that honeycomb thing, there is only pretty much one other place where you need to use this. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, nice. Yeah, there's one other place where you need the stone. Right. Go, go, go. Yeah, I like how you hear mumbo noises in the song. Alright, then we have this tiger-like creature right here. Let's go up here. I'm a new stony! I don't know. But I look kind of familiar. Are you saying we're burning bits? Guys, try to cheat, you know what I mean? Yep, it's pretty obvious. They're a bit short of place, so you might as well go in anyway. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. We also have a warp pad here as well. So we can go back in with normal banjo too. We have another stony here. Welcome to the Mayhem Amateur Kickball. We enter the quarterfinals. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna play a bit of soccer ball or football. Right here. Except they call it Mayhem Kickball. Quarterfinal. Hey, whack! Who's this, un who's this ugly new guy? Made the whistle win. So what you got to do here is you got to grab a ball and either hold one of the trigger buttons, and then you kick the ball faster. You can even charge at the enemies as well. And then you just got to put them in your goal. So yeah, that's what you got to do. It's, it's, it's just easy, right? It's only hard if you don't really, if it's like your first time, but I'm used to this, so I know what I'm doing. You don't want to like put score on the others because uh, when you put it in your own, you earn scores, so you want to get the most. And you get two score for each you put in. So I'm put in that guy there, and you see he's got like 10 now, so. Let's go. There we go. We got 26. You've won your quarterfinal. Move on to the semi-finals. So that's the uh, second one. Which we go here. G go in there! Oh my god! Yeah, the Mayhem Kickball semi-final. Those shorts look stupid. Hey! May the best story win. This time you have red ones, so what the red ones do, they lose us they 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 lose you a score. So meaning So meaning if I put that one in mine, I'll lose one score. So you wanna put the red ones in your other ones and then the yellow ones in your own. So So yeah, it's kinda cool. So meaning they can lose your score. Nope. Oh come on! No! Alright. Get that! Ugh, no! Right, I've got 14, that's enough. And then, the last one right here. 
You've won your semi-final, baby. The BM kick and final begins. So now we've just got a final one. All right. The man kick for final. Or rather the finale. You have no change, you're the common champion. Me the best still you win. This time you also have explosive ones, so if you explode them near the players, they'll be stunned slightly. So meaning you want to explode them right like that there. So let's Oh, but if you're close, then you can get stunned as well. Oh no, like that. Oh come on. Oh no, I'm so close. Oh no! Wait. Right, I better kick that right there, there we go. And then like that! Nope! Nope. Yes. And I got 11 points, so that is good. One on first try. I declare you will new win. Double challenge. And you choke for all those words. Alright, so yeah, we got our another jiggy. Okay. Now, next place. We need to go with the stony. I forgot there was another place. Now, you need to be the stony still. And remember that short one we showed off? You need to go there next. Well, first, I'm gonna... Let's get the jiggy on the uh, bridge, because we need to go in that direction anyway, so... Let's go and get this red ginger, shall we? Wow, we're the stony. Okay. And how many red gingers are there? Six red gingers, okay. Alright. Some blue eggs there. We're in the prison compound, and we need to speak to him. To free the trapped one, a star must appear before the sun rises. Another star appears, followed by two moons. Does that help? I think so. So, so star, sun, star, moon, moon. So, it's this code right here. So, so star, sun, star, no, and then moon, moon. And then there you go. Then you can go in there, but there's nothing you can do here yet, though, so... But you can uh, go... But now you're done with the stony for now, so you can go back to Wombat and transform back. So, we're pretty much done with the stony for now. We will be using them again uh, later on, but for now, we don't need to. Alright, transform back. Magic, not Alright, so. So we're, we're done with these stony for now, so. Right, let's go and get this move here. Okay. Jam jars. The grip grab, so you can grab ledges. So, kind of like other games. But except we're not gonna do that. You could also do this ground pound, and then boom. That is how some people get it. If they don't have that move, they would just do that. However, there are some times where you actually are required to use that move. So, so I guess tough luck on that. Now well, let's go in here. All right, and this is the cheat code place, the code chamber. This is where you activate my cheat stand on this podium. Right. You must spell out the cheat codes I have given you. Aim carefully. You hit a wrong letter, you have to start over. So, we got one sheet already, so it was homing, so. H. O. N. And J. Homing cheat will make your eggs homings baddies. Yeah. And it's the only cheat we've got so far. Then we go into this part here, activate it, and then the homing the homing eggs are enabled. So Okay. Now let's go up here. Now let's go get 
Oh, and then this part. This is where you really need to be careful. You can either tiptoe like this gently, or another way. Oh, you have to be really careful when you do this method, though. Well, yes, to be honest. Oh. Okay. And if you want to do this again, you have to go on that platform again. And it spits the G out. Okay. And you got to do this again. It's only hard because... Because when you do it at the right time, you have to do it at the right time. You can even tiptoe, but I don't really like doing the tiptoe method. Oh my god, it's so hard. Like, I always do this, mostly on first try. Got it! Yes! Is there anything to like, get to? You gotta be careful with these enemies as well. Thank you, you can peck while gripping ledges though. So you can kill these easily. There we go. And to get off, you just um, press B button on the Xbox. I think it was B button on the 64 as well. Uh, I think that's about it here. Like, we will come back here for more cheat codes when we get them, obviously. But for now, no more cheat codes for now. Right. Now let's go outside Mumbo's skull. And we'll go and do this, um... Let's go, in, let's go across that bridge first, and then we'll do that temple. Go away, you! And then we'll get that secret golden uh, thing for that uh, chubby fellow that we saw earlier. Right. See, flies here. With home and eggs, this is much easier. Enough of those crap jokes, lady. And we get a jiggy behind her. But we also have a honeycomb piece up there we need to get as well. So let's go and get that as well. Ah, oh, come on. Boy. Okay. But again, you don't have to use the uh, grip ledge thing. You can also do ground pound like that. That also works. Alright. Let's go in this temple then. But before that, let's actually go on top of the temple. And oh no! Let's go on top of the temple first, and then we'll go inside. Oh. Go on top and then. There you go, Jiggy on top of here. And then, we got first person mode. So it's uh, Call of Banjo or something. So you have Master the Honor. So it's induced. My prize, okay. Yeah, you can shoot eggs like this as well. And this is very cool. Shoot things, boom. It's very simple. Then we have to collect these, um, we have to collect these things. So, and to open doors, I think, was it A button? Yeah, A button to open doors. And then you'll also get extra moves on with this mode later on, so. So, there's more than this. But you'll have to learn them later on, so. With these, uh, things right there, we need to get. No, I fell off! Alright. Luckily, you can just spam the buttons as well, and then get, um, eggs that way. Nope. Just get these. Then, boom. We got them. Now, let's go this way. That's the entrance. And yeah, that sound means an enemy has reappeared, so you gotta be careful there. Oh, God damn you! Alright. Alright. 
Oh, we cannot progress from here. We have to go the other way. Go the other way! Naughty boy. Alright. There we go, there's more. And if you get ten of them, you can unlock the door. And then you need to get ten more to open another door. So, and you need to open both of them to access the boss of this place. And there is, a, and unlike Kazooie, where there's only bosses in, like, some places, in, in Tui, there's bosses in every world. So, and and there's, there's only one place where there's two bosses. And they're pretty much almost the same. Place, so, but you'll find out later on. Don't collect that. Don't want to have that. I guess that thing is useful if you have low health, but still. But it's timing it right. Because sometimes later on they can get faster. And that can very get really annoying. Alright, there's another one there. And then. Another one there. There's next to here. Get, get them! And kill him! Oh my god! And there's 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 these ones in front of here. There's also a ginger here. Yeah, there's a ginger up there. I'm gonna try and get that as well. Oh, and there's the last one you get. There is more than that, yeah, but obviously, uh, obviously you only need 20, and then all of them disappeared. So, I'm gonna get that Jinjo first, and then, um, and those eggs are special. We'll get to those in a moment as well. Um, Alright, to get that Jinjo, I think we, I think we go in this door, and then get it from here. Yeah, there we go. Nope. Right. And I'll get those eggs. What those eggs do is they allow you to have a... Uh, so it's almost like a machine gun you can have here. Uh, so it's like this, but you only have a minute to use them. So if you want to use them on the boss, then you have to enter a room first and then get them and then use these. But I pretty much don't mind. I guess I could try and be quick, so it's so a slightly sacred chamber, and we just go back, we can walk backwards here, <laughs> and then there we go, then we go in the other one, it doesn't matter what order you do as well, so if you enter this one first, then it will be the same one, then if you enter the other one, then it's lost, if you get the cutscene, then it's lost, so really sacred chamber. Look Banjo, there's another Jiggy, this is just too easy. Yep, we'll have, we'll have the game finished in no time. Well, uh, not really. Because of this dude! Oh, Tomato, thought you'd get another Jiggy that easily. Huh? We have Target Sack. Dispostic, uh, Dizzy Tone God. I am Target Sack, Mighty Mayhem God of Target Shooting. The bird will be Dart Ring. So, what you gotta do here. Is shoot the targets on them, and it's much and it's much better with the uh, diff this, these eggs that I have now. You kill these enemies easily as well. And I've only got a few minutes. To and be careful of these mouse because they can kill you as well. Wow, we're speed running this. Let's go here. There we go. And then our normal legs in here again. So we're just gonna shoot these enemies and then we're done because there's no more things gonna happen. There we go. Legs. No! You beat me! Now suffer as I evoke. And it's best to use these because the target things come out of him as he as he dies. And then you just then you can just exit this place. You're pretty much done here. Let's get out. Alright. There we go. Alright, let's get out. And then Um Let's go up 
here. Uh, no, um, it's, uh, it's this way. Oh, there we go. I think it was there. Yeah, there we go. And then we go in the middle one, and then boom. There we go. There we go. And then... You can even aim up and down as well, if you want, so... So we're pretty much done in the temple. I think we're pretty much done in Mayhem Temple. Well, there is one other thing we need to do, but, but what else is there? We've got seven Jiggies. Um, but then there's a... Wait, hold on. So I know that I know the one we need to get is that um, that other temple. We need to save some gold for that guy. I know that one. And then the other we have to get later on. I, I guess I could do some tricks, but I'm not really good at it. So but then there's another one. Like what was it? Like I don't know. Like not the Jinjos. I, I think I'll find out. Like sometimes I do forget things, but still. Alright, so let's go to that flight pad. Good here. Right, there we go. But we're landing in the water anyway, so. Because <laughs> we've got all honeycomb pieces. There's just one more Jinjo. Uh, of course, the two Jiggies. I know where two of the Jiggies are, but I forgot what the other one was. Alright. Ah, oh, come on. Alright, there we go. Let's get that Cheeto page as well. Get it! There we go. And then, there's this area right here. Which then you gotta go up here. And this actually takes you to another world entirely. Which we'll meet later in the game. So this is just a part of the world. Unga Bunga's cave. Now, this is another thing. This is another part where you gotta seek. You gotta sneak, but this is also hard. So what I do here is this. Oh, get out of Unga Bunga's cave. It'll kick you out and then you have to go back in to start over. Okay. Alright, so we gotta... And then... Oh my god! Oh, yes! Like, the, the main way you should do this is, like, tiptoe your way, so slightly hold the control stick. But that's very hard, so we I do this method instead, which is easier, and you won't get caught. Same thing with that snake we did earlier. Just gotta walk out hither. And then, and then we just gotta go here. Then, you found Target's own priceless relic thing. Okay, man, stole it. Why those fever little? Careful, this is a family friendly game. Oh, yes, so it is. Why don't I just give you a jiggy? That makes sense to me. Yeah, I wonder what he was about to say. Or was he about to, like, drop the F bomb or something? Uh -oh, Pebble gun! You in much trouble? Big beatings. Yeah, probably from your mother. I don't know. Or your father. I don't know. Well, he's off there. Then we can get that Jiggy. Uh, was it here? Yeah, no, uh, it's there. Like, I know where one other Jiggy is, but I forgot the other one. Uh, in fact, let me go back to the prison compound. A little bit. Prison compound. Okay. In fact, I'm gonna try that trick, actually. Uh, if it don't work, then we'll get it later. 
Oh yeah, the jiggy was there. Oh yeah, that was it. I guess I will get that now then. We have to grip on this. Then we get those shoes and then we get that jiggy in there. And I guess I'll try that trick. If not, then I guess we'll do it later. Yeah, the shoes weren't the same as before. Except the shoes were played there. Except these shoes are not used a lot. So, we've got to get these again. We've got 10 jiggies. But that doesn't mean we got all of them in the world, because this time it's counting the total we've actually got for the entire game. So, yeah. Alright, so what happens if you go in here? Get kicked out like that, and then this guy. He was, like, eating you the whole time. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll actually try this trick, because there's also a Cheeto page we can get as well. I think we'll have five of them then. So... So we'll have, like, five Cheeto pages then. So, I guess we'll try that out. Clamp here. And then... We'll go... Yeah, and then... And then the Jiggy. You're supposed to get, like, a move later on in the game, and then you go inside there. But I want to try this method, which is very difficult. Which you have to do, like, a long jump, and then fly, and then ground pound. You gotta try and do that, it's very hard. In fact, it's really recommended if you have, like, one of the better ground pounds in the game. You gotta do that. Yeah, it's very hard. I don't think I can do it. I'm gonna have to do the proper way later. And then you just get out of here by just going down here and then... Boom. That's how you get out. So we'll come back here later. When we have another move. Alright. So let's just leave this place then. These things sound like cats. Alright, let's go to the world entrance. And let's get out of here! Alright, and then... Let's go back to Jiggy Wiggy. Because we can go back in here now. There's that guy that I coughed at when doing his voice. <laughs> if, you, if you've seen the previous video. Okay. Alright. Let's do another puzzle. For Jiggy's Challenge 2. Or Jiggy Wiggy's Challenge 2. This time we have a cry going, ooh, <laughs> because he's sad about something. Has he lost his girlfriend or something? No, 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 just kidding. Uh, nah, I think it, it, it was like his son or something. Like, remember what we opened in Mayhem Temple? There's some, there's someone inside that. That is what he's missing. Don't know if it's like his friend or something. I don't know. His partner, I think he says, but I don't know. But, anyways. We're unlocking another world, so... We hold the power of the mighty Jiggy Wiggy! And then... In the plateau... Final hacks. Okay. And the controller's rumbling bad. Come on. And then destroy that! But we can actually do another challenge as well! We can unlock another world! You are indeed the chosen one. You also have enough Jiggies to attempt Jiggy Wiggy's Challenge 3. And I'm actually gonna do that now. So this one looks different. I wonder what this place is. Oh, he's trying to slam Banjo there. Stop it. Stop it, dude. Get on there! Right. Oh, there's one, there's like, there's one of the polar bears we gave a present to in the first game up there. Dressed differently. Okay. That's interesting. Behold the power of mighty Jiggy Wiggy! Alright, I'm gonna put the controller on the microphone. In the pine grove this time. Oh wow. Alright. Oh, Open the park, it seems like. Close, no entry. Nope! It's open! <laughs> but we 
do not have enough jiggies for the next one, so we have to come back later for that. Oh boy! Right then, how do you get to those places? Well, you go well not in not in Mayhem Temple, but next to Mayhem Temple, find this place here. Then you kill him. You get another energy. You need it. Then that is where this is where the plateau is. All right, right here. You gotta be careful here because you might die. And also, above the sign, there are notes in the hub world as well. So, meaning you gotta collect notes here as well. And there's a Jinjo in here. Let's try and get him. We cannot. Not even with a glitch. Okay. Up here, there's the silo we can use to walk here. Again. Let's kill him. deserve to be alive. Alright, and then, here's another Jam Jars area. This time, fire eggs! So we have different element eggs in this game, which is very neat. Now... Okay. That's very cool. So we have, we only have 50 uh, for now. But again, there's a cheat where you can increase your capacity on certain items. And to check Jags, I think... It, well, it's the, um... It's the, um... The RB button on Xbox. On Xbox. And then... I think just the R button on uh, Nintendo 64. So... And then this is where the pine probe is. Right here. Where there's not only there's more notes and a silo, but also another jam jars! And water. Right there. The grenade eggs. Now these eggs are completely broken. You have 25 for now. But these eggs are completely broken. You'll see why later on. So yeah. Completely broken eggs. Uh, and there's more notes down here, so we'll get these. Alright. Okay. Now let's, um... We'll do one more thing in the pine grove before... Uh, before we end it off. We can show off how you walk as well. And there you go. Even though we could have walked back, but still. I would, oh, I would much prefer uh, warping than walking, so. More notes here! Alright. And a honeycomb piece there. And we can go in this honey thing right here, massive one. And we're in Honeybee's Hive. Big Bear, I'm Honey Bee, Mistress of Honey. Ah, why can't you be Mistress of Jiggies instead? Because that would have been made your quest too easy. However, I can bring you extra energy units in return for empty honeycombs. I suppose that would be better than nothing. Don't be so rude, Kazooie. Oh, sorry, Wasp Lady. I'm Honey Bee, a bee. Right, you are. Honest girl. You have enough honeycombs for two more units of energy. Do you want to trade? Yes, definitely. Uh, sure, honey. Just your honey. Here, big bear. Here's your extra energy. Okay. We've got two extra extra pieces here. Here we go. And we need five for the next one, so... So we'll have to come back here later. Oh no, we're not getting that, no! In fact, there's one more thing we can do, and it's in the Jinjo village. Remember those travel cliffs I was on about, where you get 20, um, jiggies each? Well, there is actually one on top of the red Jinjo house, I believe. I think it's on top of the red one. Yeah, it's on top of the red one. Uh, on top of this one. Grab the ledge right here. And there's a treble clef right here. There you go. I guess you could also try and get this one another way, but I never managed to, unfortunately. So, bad one there. 
Alright, so that'll be it for today's video, guys. So next time on Banjo-Tooie, we'll go in this next area right here. So I guess I should see you guys next time. Video game jam poops out. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!